कमिंग टू निर्मला इन अमेरिक आई आई यू नो एट द वर्स रविदास मैं रोत्रे जी और बुकल नवाब जी आ रहा हूं आपके पास दो मिनट में बट द पॉइंट हेयर इज दिस दैट देर इज नथिंग मोर क्रिमिनल नथिंग मोर क्रिमिनल देन ट्राइंग टू स्प्रेड कॉम्युनल टेंशन एंड इफ अ स्टेट गवर्नमेंट Yes. Approves the spreading of communal tension for petty politics. No, but uh, no. But let me add there one is, point. That here. is an act of the greatest criminality. In that case, the state government is complicit in spreading communal disharmony in the state. The state government is supposed to protect law and order, and the UP government is claiming that Durga Shakti was trying to spread communal harmony. Akhilesh Yadav says the suspension was right. पुलिस रिकॉर्ड्स आप सुन लीजिए रविदास जी और बुकल नवाब जी आप हाथ ऊपर कर रहे हैं मगर पुलिस रिकॉर्ड्स जो है वो आपके मुख्यमंत्री को कॉन्ट्रोडिक्ट करते हैं कोई केस भी नहीं फाइल हुआ था वॉल के डेमोलेशन पे आप सांप्रदायिक तनाव बढ़ाने की कोशिश क्यों कर रहे हैं वाई यू ट्राइंग टू स्प्रेड कॉम्युनल टेंशन इन योर ओन स्टेट यू आंसर दैट क्वेश्चन कोई बुलडोजर भी नहीं गया कवर अप टू कवर अप योर टू कवर अप योर करप्शन You want to spread communal tension? जिस तरीके से जिलाधिकारी ने रिपोर्ट दी है कि वहां के ऊपर जो है वहां पे लोगों ने खुद अपने हाथों से दीवार गिराई है या अपने हाथों से पूरा घर गिराया है ये तो मतलब समझ में समझ में आने वाली बात नहीं है लेकिन एक बात समझ में जरूर आती है कि जब सही बात है वही कहेंगे जो आपके खिलाफ बोल रहे हैं उसको आप कहेंगे कि झूठ बोल रहे हैं और ऊपर से चीफ मिनिस्टर चीफ मिनिस्टर जो इन मामले में खुद दाखिल नहीं होना चाहिए वो खुद आकर के बोल रहे हैं कि एसडीएम ने गलत किया है और छोटे छोटे छंदा कलेक्ट करके दीवार बनाने वाले जनता के खिलाफ है वो निर्णय में आ चुके हैं क्या कैसे बोल सकते हैं चीफ मिनिस्टर ऐसे ही शुड नॉट बी सिटिंग ऑन जजमेंट ऑन दिस मैटर ही ऑलरेडी प्री प्रोसेस दिस मैटर एंड आप लोग उनके डीएम के रिपोर्ट के नकारते हुए आप सीएम एक पोजीशन लेते हुए आप क्या न्याय करेंगे आप कैसे वाले ऐसे कानून की रक्षा करने वाले अधिकारी गण को आप कैसे न्याय दिलाए और आप और आप कैसे किसी को अक्यूज कर सकते हैं आप उस आप उस ऑनेस्ट ऑफिसर को अक्यूज कर रहे हैं आप कह रहे हैं कि वो सांप्रदायिक तनाव बढ़ा रही है आप आप कैसे वो कह सकते हैं जब सारे अफसर सारे प्रूफ जितने रिकॉर्ड सारा पीपल एंड पीपल 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 एवरीबॉडी इज सेइंग दैट यू आर यू आर यू आर टॉक यू आर स्प्रेडिंग फॉल्स और आप क्या डीएम को भी सस्पेंड करेंगे क्या अगर आप, आप फिर डीएम को भी सस्पेंड कर लीजिए क्योंकि झूठ बोल रहे हैं डीएम को भी सस्पेंड कर लीजिए करेंगे नहीं करेंगे करेंगे नहीं करेंगे ये ये बात का मुद्दा है हमारा जो भस्मा सुर क्या इसमें चर्चा कर रहे जबरदस्त है क्या आप शुरू से गलत आरोप लगा रहे हैं जिलाधिकारी के ऊपर गलत आरोप लगा रहे हैं बिल्कुल गलत आरोप है बिल्कुल गलत आरोप है और अगर अगर आयुक्त ने भी यही रिपोर्ट दी तो आप आयुक्त के ऊपर भी गलत आरोप लगाएंगे और उसके ऊपर अगर प्रमुख सचिव का रिपोर्ट देगा तो उसके ऊपर भी गलत आरोप लगाएंगे क्योंकि आपको अपना आपको अपना भ्रष्टाचार छुपाना है इसलिए और ऊपर से एस के लाइन और डीएम के लाइन एक ही लाइन है तो एस के ऊपर कार्रवाई क्यों रुक गए डीएम के ऊपर भी ले डीएम को डीएम को भी सस्पेंड करें फिर नो नो वन सेकेंड वॉट आर वी सींग ऑन वॉट आर वी सींग ऑन न्यूज आर टू नाइट आई वॉन्ट टू एक्सप्लेन वॉट्स गोइंग ऑन फॉर द न्यूज ऑफ यूर यू हैव एन इनक्रेडिबल सिचुएशन डियर व्यूअर्स वे यू हैव टू पॉलिटिशियंस फ्रॉम द रूलिंग पार्टी इन उत्तर प्रदेश वन मिनट सर लेट मी स्पीक बोलने दीजिए हमें समय आ गया है लोगों को बोलने के लिए यू हैव टू लीडर्स ऑफ द रूलिंग पार्टी ऑन द न्यूज आर टू नाइट हुआ सेंग वी विल सैक एवरीबडी इफ रिक्वायर यू आप सबको सबको निकाल देंगे क्योंकि सब लोग सच कह रहे हैं मगर सच करने कह, सच कहने का अधिकार नहीं है उनके पास सिर्फ झूठ बोलने का अधिकार आपके पास है लोगों के पास सच बोलने का अधिकार नहीं है आपको क्या लगता है डू यू थिंक यू ओन उत्तर प्रदेश यू थिंक यू ओन द स्टेट यू आर ऑल्सो रिस्पॉन्सिबल फॉर द कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन ऑफ दिस कंट्री सर प्लीज डोंट फोगेट दैट डोंट फोगेट दैट एंड आई आई डोंट डोंट फोगेट दैट डोंट मेक अप द फैक्ट देर हैजू बी अ लिमिट टू फॉल्सो सस्पेंड किया 
Well, I want to go to Shailesh Gandhi who is listening on very disturbed to this. I, you know, you know, just you, you have a situation where this where this young woman is taken on the sand mafia. She is being told that by the state government that she is spreading communal trouble. Those who are saying and supporting her, those including the district magistrate, who have submitted a report to the UP, UP government saying Durga Shakti has not done anything wrong. Today they are being threatened that they will also face action. So what kind of a situation is this, Shailesh Gandhi? What kind of politics and governance is this? Can the we, whole system is coming together to it, teach it one officer a lesson. Malika Sarabhai wants to come back, but let's get uh, Shailesh Gandhi in. Is, this is ridiculous, this line of argument. It is obvious that the Samaj Party representatives are lying and have no sense of shame. But out of this debate, can we get something positive? There are other political people who are representing the BJP and other parties, Congress and so on. Can we get a promise from them that they will not rest until justice is done to this young girl? Can we get Absolutely. Nirmala Sitaraman to say yeah, that they will raise this in parliament right. and not allow parliament right. to function until justice is yeah. done? Because yeah. if we do that, across the country the message will go Why not that change in system? bureaucrats who Mr. are being Gandhi. honest cannot Why be targeted. Not change in system? Absolutely. Nirmala, ball is in your court. Absolutely. I think you've uh, raised a very pertinent point, Mr. Gandhi, and uh, it is not within my capacity to say, yes, we certainly do it in the parliament, because that's a prerogative of the parliamentary party. I am not uh, running away from the issue. You've raised will a you very try? pertinent will point, and I'm sure my party will seriously consider, because we've already expressed, we've already expressed <laughs> our line of argument that we are seeing a complete injustice being done for this woman, and therefore the party will certainly take it up yeah. and I may not be able to give the promise because I am not a competent person to do that. The parliamentary party will certainly take it because we take it as a very serious, a very serious situation in Uttar Pradesh where already and law and order is miserable and you have hardly any few officers who are able to stand up to the challenge and, and of the I, government. I, I also want to know here today that you have one minute, uh, uh, Ravidas Mehrotra ji, what do you think of Azam Khan? Who does Azam Khan think he is that he can insult all the people of this country and speak that kind of language that he did yesterday? Durga Shakti ke baare mein unhone kaha Ram naam ki loot hai, loot sako to loot lo This is a minister? This is a leader of the Samajwadi party, he says, he says something like that? Isn't that shameful? How low can you fall? Koi koi koi, humare country mein political discourse ka koi level nahi hai? जो कार्रवाई हुई है उस कार्रवाई से खनन माफियाओं को संबंध नहीं है उन्होंने वो ईमानदार अधिकारी हैं उन्होंने खनन माफियाओं पर कार्रवाई करी उसके खिलाफ कोई कार्रवाई नहीं हुई है और प्रदेश सरकार की उन्होंने मंशा के अनुसार से वहां पर जो खनन माफिया काम कर रहे हैं हम आपके बात को नहीं मान सकते हैं क्योंकि अगर वो सच है नहीं अगर वो सच है बीच में ये कम्युनल डिसामनी के बात कहां से आई वो दीवार की बात क्यों आई वो दीवार तोड़ने वाले बात क्यों आई अगर आपके इन्वेस्टिगेशन में कानून माफिया के साथ कुछ भी नहीं है बीच में ये कम्युनल दंगे के बात क्यों आई can you allow an honest officer to be branded communal? I want to go, go back once again to Uma Shankar Khushbu, I am coming to you. The challenge is this, the challenge is this, a very honest IAS officer who worked hard, came 20th in the merit list in this country in the year 2010. She is being branded communal because she took on the sand mafia. Can the country allow this to happen? That's the simple point tonight. There are many communal people in this country. But if you let this 28-year-old IAS officer be branded communal, then I think it is a disgrace for this country. And this whole country would feel let down by it. There will be many people hanging their heads in shame. And there will be many young officers and aspirants and teenagers who are hoping to serve the government who will feel disheartened that this is what happened. This is the price of honesty in our country. Uh, I want to go back to Uma Shankar. That's the real irony of this, isn't it, Uma Shankar? That not only will you punish someone, you will Arnab, label someone communal to serve and for your vote net. bank politics. That's ridiculous. You will go this Arnab, far. Arnab, Arnab, you have said it right. Arnab, you have said it right. Uh, earlier, the politicians were were not touching the young IAS officers. They were touching officers only <coughs> about ten years of service. Now this is a case where less than four year old IAS officer has been suspended for standing upright, and that to a woman IAS officer. 
now from this the country should have some relief right uh, right right from uh, the independence the politicians are controlling that the ruling party is controlling the ias officers As, of course the ips officers also shouldn't we have a civil service commission like the way the uk has the usa has the upsc union public service commission which selects the ias officers which recruits the ias officer why not it be entrusted with the task of transferring disciplining and all that promoting ias officers if such an independent commission takes care this type of things will not happen why shouldn't we consider like this yeah i, I agree with you but you see they make this fake case they make this fake 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 case that durga shakti is creating communal disharmony yes shazia yes that's very yeah. dangerous arnab you know joseph stalin's aide who was the head of kgb he said find me a man show me a man and i'll find you the crime so this is what happened with durga you know she only because she took up cudgels against san mafia she stood up to she stood up to goons that's why they invented and cooked up the story but imagine how dangerous these people are how divisive the politics is how scary it is for india to have heads of state you know different uh you know states like up and many other states in this country people heading these governments who think in this dangerous fashion who will who will cook up a riot who will imagine a situation and probably take it there to ensure that corruption is not exposed and the people and this whole gundara stays and is perpetuated and that is so scary i mean I, I, you don't know how to react to that how can you but fight at that one point, at, 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 at one point at one point shazia political parties political parties well, no i i i don't want to, i don't want to sound preachy about this but but political parties will have to somewhere put the national interest ahead khushbu i know you are also supporting the upa but what is happening is that if molam had not been a upa partner maybe they would have had a more you know tougher way of dealing with him because he is a upa partner and there is a parliament session and molam has already been creating trouble over a food security bill and if he wants he can potentially stop other bills so what you are doing is basically the governing class in delhi and lucknow has realized that yes there may be injustice that is happening there may be injustice that has happened to this girl a uh, yeah, yeah, young ias officer but that's a small matter let her face injustice we have bigger deals to do in delhi that's it there's been a trade off yeah. that we have we have a arrangement going on in yeah. delhi that does not upset the arrangement even if durga shakti remain suspended gets charged cheated and made an example of that is all and that somewhere is hurting that's hurting everyone's conscience does it hurt your conscience kushbu does it hurt your conscience it hurts my